This video is brought to you by SailRite. Visit SailRite.com for all your project supplies, tools, and instructions. Use the W1 hand press to set vent grommets, sometimes known as ventilators, using these die sets. Add vent grommets to cushions, boat covers, and more to add airflow and prevent moisture buildup that causes mold and mildew to grow. Each set contains three dies that both cut the hole and set your vent grommets. In this video, we will quickly show how to install vent grommets using the W1 hand press ventilator die set and hole cutter. First, we need to remove the upper head of the W1 and remove the nylon cutting block from the base of the press in order to install the cutting die. The cutting die is installed in the top of the W1 hand press and works in conjunction with the nylon cutting block. Once installed, place the nylon cutting block back on the tool's base. Bill will now take our sample piece of vinyl and slide it underneath the press. Depress the lever and your hole is cut. Once our holes are cut, we are ready to install the setting dies. Remove the nylon cutting block and unscrew the hole cutting die. Install the upper grommet setting die into the top of the W1. Before installing the bottom die, Bill points out the cutout on the bottom of the die to show where the vent portion of the grommet should sit during the installation process. He then installs the lower die into the base of the W1. Tighten down the lower die with an Allen wrench on the side of the hand press. Doing this ensures the lower die won't move during the installation process. We are now ready to set our vent grommets. The washer portion of the grommet should always have the ridge end pointing down towards the vent as you can see here. We will begin the installation process with the outside surface of our fabric facing the tabletop. We will want to slide our vent portion of the grommet underneath the vinyl and push it up through our hole. We are now ready to install the washer portion of the grommet around the barrel of the vent portion of the grommet. Remember to always have the ridge portion of the washer facing down like it is here. We will now place our vinyl and grommets over top of our grommet setting dies. You can see here, Bill shows where the vent portion of the grommet should sit on the lower die. Simply depress the lever and your grommet is set. It takes very light pressure to set vent grommets with the W1. We will install another vent grommet to show just how fast the W1 hand press is when coupled with the W1 hand press ventilator die set and hole cutter. Make sure the ridge portion is face down around the barrel. We will then slide our application underneath the press. Depress the lever and your ventilator grommet is set. Speed up production and increase accuracy using the W1 hand press ventilator die set and hole cutter. Sailrite carries a variety of different vent grommets and W1 hand press ventilator die and hole cutter sets for your next DIY project. If you have any questions about this process or any of these products, feel free to contact Sailrite. Thanks for watching.